Hey folks, my name is Ravish and welcome back to another video. Now this video is the second update that I'm giving in Microsoft Build Cloud Development Challenge. The idea, uh, the purpose of this video is to tell you how things will go as soon as you start doing the modules, how it will look like in your system and how will you rank and where where is the proper uh, progress that you can see. That is uh, the first thing. The second thing, I'm gonna take a few questions. Uh, I have seen a lot of people who have commented on my video that okay this is possible okay if the voucher is possible az 900 uh, ai 900 what exactly is happening over here so this is what i'm gonna answer in today's video all right so uh, before moving further kindly subscribe the channel because that would really support me to create more content like this all right so uh, without further ado let us dive right into the video okay so as you can see on my screen right now the current status at the time of recording of this video is 24 days 21 minutes and 38 seconds so you still have 24 days to complete this now sometime what is happening is uh, there are total 36 modules in the challenge that i'm doing i'm doing a cloud development challenge i'm not sure what you are doing because that would differ in terms of the number of the modules you have completed now uh, i have been doing this uh, since uh, since uh, i guess three four days uh, and you can see this describe core azure architectural components it's 100 percent done i'll just uh, refresh this to show you the latest update so for me everything is completed over here uh, this is completed everything is done for me and the thing is if i've completed everything the question can come uh, that uh, why it is showing as 32 uh, by uh, 36 right now because it takes some time to update for me it will take one hour i'll just refresh it and i think it will complete and uh, i have completed this so basically i'll just sign in quick uh, quickly so ravish Ravot at live dot in uh, sorry my spelling is wrong over here yeah and you can see that modules I have completed is 36 by 36 right now so it will take up to a uh, half an hour one hour it will update automatically so do not worry about that and it will say congratulations you have completed the challenge okay so if you come down you can see a lot of participants right now so 37,418 participants right now who are looking into this and this is where i am i have completed all the modules uh, there is no ranking there is no position it does not matter probably it is taking uh, the people who have completed it early but that does not matter you have a lot of time like 24 days to complete this okay so that is one thing okay uh, i'll just refresh this and you will see the status and you can see this is 100 percent completed everything is 100 percent completed over here so uh, this is done for me and i'll wait for the voucher uh, probably by next month i'll be having that okay so uh, this is one uh, first topic that I have resolved for you. I hope you have understood it. Let's go to the videos that I have created. Okay, so this was the first video I have created two weeks back and I was announcing that Azure Free Certification Voucher is on. So uh, let's take a lot of, uh, there would be a, a few questions that I'll take. So uh, this is uh, the first comment is from Vikram. Thank you for information. It's fine. So this is the first question. If I sign up for this challenge and I want to complete AZ104 certification, what amount of time do I need to invest for learning this challenge in terms of minimum number of hours? So a lot of people are asking me this question that uh, what if I do AZ104? So the answer that I gave this challenge is not applicable for AZ104, which is the Azure admin exam, if I am, if I remember correctly. So uh, this is not applicable. You have to take uh, any challenge. And uh, the thing is, I'm not sure uh, whether the uh, whether the voucher that you will get uh, is applicable to other exam or not. Because uh, last time when I saw, I uh, I did not get a voucher. I, they told me that I'm just eligible to take exam AZ400 and I took that exam and passed it. I did not get a separate voucher for that. That's what I remember. So I hope you have understood this question. The next question is from Deepak. Uh, thanks for the update. One question, do we need to complete the certification AZ104 on our own in order to get the free certification AZ400. So uh, basically, if you have already done AZ104 uh, and if you do AZ400, you will get a, uh, a badge, a certification badge that you have cleared. But it's not hard and fast rule that you cannot give AZ400 exam. You can give and you can get certified. It just it needs a prerequisite. So it's totally upon you if you want to do it. And if not, that's completely OK. You can still write the exam. OK, so someone is saying thank you. I'll just uh, reply my glad you liked it okay um can i apply for this challenge now i'm not sure whether you can apply for this challenge right now because uh, the window is over but i'll still try let's see if we can do that 
uh thanks for sharing perfect or me i want to get the cert microsoft certificate but is there any prerequisite like microsoft build 365 developer challenge no there is no such prerequisite i've also answered this uh, you can start anytime but it is preferred to have a have easy 900 exam passed which is the very basic and fundamental exam for azure i hope you will pass it because or you you have to have a uh, working experience on any public cloud that would be really helpful so this is the answer to your question or me Hello, thanks for the information. Can I choose DevOps and complete models to get certificate? And then meanwhile, before September, can I clear AZ-104 so I can use this challenge? Um, probably if you will uh, write AZ-104 uh, anytime before September, and then you go for AZ-400, and then I think you will be able to get that certification badge. But even if you do it first, AZ-400, and you do AZ-104 afterwards, then also it should work fine. So it won't be a problem. You just have to have both of them in uh, in a span in which one of those certifications should not expire, must not expire. Okay, thanks for the video. Uh, for Azure Administrator, which challenge should we take? There is no specific challenge for that, uh, as I've already told, so uh, I cannot say anything about it. There is no official information, basically. Hello, bro, if I complete module two, module in two days, basically, he wants to say, will I have to wait for June or will I give voucher in three to four days of completion? Uh, Good question because even I have completed all the modules within four days and uh, because this was a weekend and I was uh, studying it so I have completed it probably you also might have completed it so you I don't think you will get uh, a certification voucher within three to four days as far as I understand you will be uh, getting it uh, by the end of next month probably 30 June but if you will uh, if you'll get uh, some kind of a voucher or some kind of mails I will keep an eye on this I'll create an update video on that and I would be updating you folks all right so just uh, stay tuned uh, hit the like button and uh, subscribe to my channel and keep all the notifications on so that you never miss a video okay uh, why are you not clarifying the doubts about az104 i just cleared i'm sorry i was late about it uh, because i have a full-time job and i'm sorry that i was not uh, early but that's what it is says I didn't receive any mail, but I'm accessing the course. Is it possible or not? Sir, tell me, please. So first of all, uh, sometimes what happens, you do not see a mail, but go to your spam folder, go to your junk uh, junk folder. You might see that mail because if you have registered and you have got the mail that thanks for registering, there's a definite chance that you have got the mail. Just uh, type Microsoft build and probably you will be seeing the mail. So that's uh, that's I think uh, is one thing. If you have registered, you will get the mail. There is no doubt about that. Okay. Uh, how do I get a voucher for AZ-104? I've already answered it for Sunny. Uh, can we register again at the earlier register mail? Yes, you can. Because the email ID that I used last time uh, was, uh, uh, I am using it right now. So you can register, so that's not a problem. But uh, the thing is, if you want to register from some other ID, you can do that as well. Prefer uh, an Outlook, uh, live.com, live.in or Hotmail ID because that's what uh, Microsoft is really comfortable with. You can uh, use other IDs as well, email IDs, Gmail IDs basically. But uh, uh, preferred is the one that I'm telling. Okay. Uh, hi, bro. I did what you're saying, but sessions are not coming. Sessions were not coming because it was uh, not 23rd. So probably you will be seeing it by now. Thanks, Prakash, for your question. Saheli Saha. Hi, I want to give AZ-104, but I didn't give AI-900. It does not matter. It is nowhere related. Uh, and even if you are trying to say AZ-900, it does not matter either way. Uh, AI-900 is probably for artificial intelligence. AZ-900 is for the basic ones. Uh, and even AZ-104 will be my first exam. Then I will be eligible to get certification or not. There is no criteria. Just pick the exam, study and take it. But uh, I would prefer that if you have already public cloud knowledge, then it's good for you. Okay. Ravish Bhaiya, how uh, Parag says that how to take challenge for AZ-10. Right now, uh, there is no aligning challenge for that. But if in this uh, in this uh, campaign, if you get a voucher, you can try to use it with the other exam. I'm not sure that will work because long back, like in around 2020, it used to work, but I'm not sure it will work now. Uh, is this free voucher for AZ-900? There is no nothing for AZ-900 if I remember correctly. Uh, it's uh, it's for the other exam uh, which I showed in my first video. I want to do DevOps, one is necessary to do administration one to get certification. It's not necessary, but uh, it's kind of a preferred thing. If you want to do it, great. If you already have worked on Azure Cloud, it it is not uh, it's not a compulsion. Why AZ-104 is showing aligning challenge not applicable? AZ means not free. This is something even I am not sure about. As far as I understand, uh, AZ-104, uh, you won't be getting any vouchers for that. But uh, if this time you're getting voucher, you can try using that. I'm not sure about that, but stay tuned. If I get any information from any other website or from Microsoft or anywhere, I would be creating a video for that especially. Okay, uh, you can 
only earn one free voucher per challenge period or one for a lifetime you can earn one uh, you user one email id you get uh, one certification and then you can use that and that would be for a uh, valid for uh, two years but uh, you have to clear the exam before 30 september if i remember correctly and uh, that exam would be uh, valid for like around one or two years depending on the type of exam for example if you take az 400 you would be valid for around uh, two years if i remember correctly okay how to get free vouchers for fundamental az 900 and dp 900 probably they are not available this time but stay tuned maybe in the future because microsoft keep uh, keep on organizing these kind of campaigns and they do give free vouchers so stay tuned are we getting mails yet yes we have already got paying 155 115 usd is mandatory no zero you have to give zero how to register for az 900 it's not there by dp 100 k liye milega kya voucher that uh, roughly translate to that uh, do we get voucher for dp 300 i don't think so right now you can get it you can only get it for the ones that you already uh, saw in my first video okay this was the update one video that i created uh, yeah, uh, make sure to follow my Hindi channel as well. Uh, if you are from uh, uh, Southeast Asia and you understand Hindi or Urdu, feel free to please follow uh, this channel. Uh, I'd be creating content soon on this channel as well. So completed all the modules, finger crossed now. Perfect. Uh, Sangati Vish, uh, Vamsi Krishna. Thank you, Ravish Bhai. If you are new to this course, now you can register and try to complete the modules, right? Or else directly you can register for the free voucher for certification. Please let me know. So I've replied, I don't understand the question because if you have already registered, just complete the modules and you're good to go. Yes, it would be free without completing. There would be no certification. Okay. Uh, Kostov says, Ravish Bhai, for the voucher, do we need to give any assessment after module completion or just need to complete the modules? And that's, that's it. You just need to complete the modules and you do not have to have anything. Ganesh Surya Polineni uh, is uh, appreciating my work. I know uh, him uh, from the LinkedIn. Uh, he's quite active there. So you can go check out. Uh, his LinkedIn and send a friend request to him. Gyanshri, hi Ravish, loved your content. Thank you, thanks a lot. Parag and again says for AZ400, can we perform any of the challenge? Be any specific challenge? So this is something I'm not sure about. So let's complete any one challenge. If I get voucher, we will try to use it for 104. But I will, I highly doubt uh, that it, it's it's possible. Okay. So I didn't get any mail like that. I have registered for a challenge. If you have not got any mail like any, uh, you have registered for the challenge. Make sure to ch check your junk folder. Make sh sure to check your spam folder. And if you have not got it, that means that uh, uh, you lost the chance this time. But do not get disheartened. You will get another chance within a few months, like four or five months. Because I have, I remember I created the same video in the month of November or December. Okay, so done. Perfect. Uh, sir, it's is it possible that we can get another free certification in different account? Yes, you can. So uh, one email ID, one certification. So you can use that. Okay. Is the voucher available for AZ-900? Unfortunately, not this time. Uh, but uh, we used to have some training days. Uh, I'm not sure whether they are active right now or not, but people can go through training for two days for around three to four hours, uh, three to six hours, and then they can get a voucher. Right now, I'm not sure, but I will create a video if I have any information like that. Okay. For AZ-104, uh, there is no course to complete and I want a voucher for this exam which challenge to select please let me know for az104 there is no challenge so sorry vikrant i do not have answer to this question after how much time completion of course they will send the voucher i think on or before 30th june but if i'll get the voucher before that or the eligibility uh, mail before that i'll create a video and post it over here sir ansel garad the modules k to milinga voucher okay so this roughly uh, uh, roughly translates to uh, that uh, if I give a wrong answer to uh, for the modules, do I get the voucher? Yes, you will get the voucher. But uh, what you can do is you can just try to if you do not know the answer or uh, try to attempt uh, if you get the wrong one, uh, reattempt the exam and you will get uh, get everything right. But yeah, try to do it all green or uh, do not uh, go for the wrong ones. I mean, uh, if, if you have four questions and three are uh, correct and one is wrong, try to do it, retake the exam and then make sure you go all green. It's a safer choice to do. Okay. DevOps ka voucher hai kya isme, uh, which roughly translates to do we have DevOps voucher? I think uh, T point meant uh, he has used uh, Arjun Reddy's uh, picture. So DevOps uh, voucher, it means uh, he might be asking about AZ400. Yes, we do have for AZ400. Can I connect you with you via DM for help? Uh, sure, Avinash, feel free to DM me on LinkedIn. I'm quite active there. So I'm quite active on LinkedIn. Feel free to send me a request. Just type Ravi Shravat and you would be able to find me in the top three people. Uh, and send me a friend request and uh, connect with me. Okay, so I hope all the questions uh, and answers are clear uh, from here. Do uh, like like the video because I need 
uh, likes and uh, subscribe i need your support uh, for this channel and if there is any question feel free to comment again under this video in the comment section and i'll address that i try to answer all of my question and i try to respond to everything you can see that i have almost rep uh, replied to almost every every question okay so uh, i hope you have uh, got the idea uh, if there is anything feel free to comment below under this video and if there is anything uh, you need on my end to answer uh, separately or for any devops question feel free to comment and i'll see you in the next one